Dave, many congratulations. From a neutral's point of view, that was a mouth-watering match between you and Mark Allen. Both of you had hatfuls of errors, but what a comeback from 3-0 and 5-2 down. Yeah, e easily uh, one of my best ever wins. You know, forget the performance side. It was a struggle for both of us out there. I just um, I think that's what gave me a bit of hope that I could see Mark was obviously struggling. So if I could just keep the match somehow going as long as possible, you never know. And uh, it was lovely to finish off strong. You did really well to keep your frustration under control where perhaps a few years ago you wouldn't have been that mature, especially, you know, in the sixth when you had that chance to go three apiece. He re-establishes a two-frame cushion. Years gone by, your head might have dropped. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, it's something I've really worked very hard on the uh, last few years. It's not always been perfect and I'll never be Mark Selby, you know, but I've definitely improved in that area and it's definitely the reason why I've uh, done better. Your record in the UK is, is quite strange, isn't it? Because we've seen you go deep at many other tournaments and now at last you're a proven ranking event winner. But in 18 previous years, you've only ever made the last 16 once. So this is turning into a big opportunity for you. Yeah, it's always been an absolute nightmare this time of year for me. Uh, the York, you know, I come here every year excited. It's a great, great venue, great crowds. You want to be a part of it and it's always been a disaster. You know, I've had many first round bomb outs in this, in this thing. So I, I, everyone keeps going on about the, the list of top players that are out, you know, and trying to get me to say something. I, I won't look for any further than my next game, you know. Of course, I'm here to win it. Uh, but I've never shown anything that, that says I will win it before. So let's just take one at a time. But talking about your next opponent, Andy Hicks, I think he might have won three final frame deciders to to get back in the last 16. He hasn't been this far for over 20 years. You're going to be the favourite for that match. Yeah, yeah, possibly, yeah. But um, like I said, I just play the table now. I won't get carried away. Mate's texting you all kinds of silly things. You know, I don't, I don't get, buy into any of that. Uh, just play the table and uh, just control what I can, I can do. And uh, we'll go from there. I'm sure Andy's excited for the game. You know, he's earned a few quid. He's in the last stage of a, a massive event. So he'll be confident as well. So, uh, but hopefully I, I get the result. And just clarify the position, because by the time we next see you, it will be December, not Movember. Is the Tash staying? It's got to, really, hasn't it? Yeah, the Tash will definitely stay until we're done with this comp. So hopefully it stays till uh, late Sunday night.